think I made that mistake before. What? Was it Thunder's Reign? It, he beat Thunder's Falcon. Okay. In pools at Clutch City Clash. Because I remember mixing that up before it was a different player. Yep. So All right. And Lux, Lux Banana setups on Spaces are just so rough because it's fast followers. Ooh. All right. Reflecting the banana. Staying in shine to be able to get that banana back into his control. And Luck tripping up on it because he doesn't really, I don't think he's ever expected a Falco to stay in shield that, in shine that long. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Shine can actually be used for its intended purpose in this game. Sometimes. All right. Rolls back and able to get the shield out in time before getting punished. Yeah. Small conversion there. Just jab uh, down here. Yep. Snaps directly to the ledge. Manages to make it back. Good DI there on the shine from Luck, making sure that he can't get any follow ups from it, though. Like, honestly, like, Falco's combo game is so much harder when opponents in DI well. Like, you really have to catch people off guard. Oh, yeah. DI and SDI can ruin combo characters. Yeah, it's, it's just like, well, okay. I had a plan for that, but no more. I mean, that that's how it's sort of out. Ooh. Oh! Oh! Up B. Yo! Oh, jeez, them. Did he trade the stock for that? I mean, he was at a bit of a higher percent. I still feel like he could have made a lot of mileage off of that first stock, but it's luck. Yeah. He's honestly able to run train. And as soon as he gets, like, in position, he's pretty good to go. Up smash, getting shine for it. All right. Birdman's one of the few people that I see that try to, like, compete with the banana and do a good job with it, too. Like, Birdman yeah. has an excellent item game. Born out of I'm not sure what, but he is very, very good at it. Oh, yeah. He's, his movement's good. His tech skill's, like, phenomenal. Yeah. Like, it's just really fun to watch him. Yeah, there is a reason he is top ten. That was an odd little moment where they just both kind of looked at each other. Lux said, I guess I'll up smash. Went for it. Yeah, and Birdman, while being down, isn't playing like he's down. He's doing good. Staying confident. Staying clean. Good DI to survive that yeah. forward air. Ooh, and good. actually, AGT yep. to survive and to his death. Yeah, the response of AGT is something that I see Birdman do a lot. Like, he's super quick on them. He's completely willing to just jump in on it. No fear. For those that don't know, you can actually... Um, Catch an item and AGT in the exact same air dodge. Yep. You air dodge initially to catch the item, and before your air dodge ends, you input AGT, which can basically just be um, C stick in a direction. Yep. And uh, and it'll happen. Yeah. It's is pretty. It, is it only C stick? Uh, it can be C stick. It can be Z as well, except if you're a tether character. Tether characters cannot use Z because okay. it launches their tether. And that's the stock. Ooh, Birdman, Birdman bringing it back to one one. Really good. Does get a sort of tech chase on that platform for a good 40%. Ooh, luck, luck just keeps going. Oh my god. No. See, all right. Birdman firing back. Managed to get some shine pressure going. All right. A really Getting good. the item up. All right. Luck has his banana. Birdman, Birdman has, has banana. banana. <laughs> the banana has been trading hands a lot this game. All right. And throws out another one. Birdman manages to grab it. Oh, misses the combo setup with it. Luck gets it back. Uh, back into Birdman's hands. Well, the funny thing about uh, banana is. Um, Diddy Kong has like a really good rushdown game, can do really good stuff on your shield, but most of it just uh, used because banana is so good on shield. Mm -hmm. And the only way to get banana is to sort of back off from the oh. punch game and throws the banana out. Sniping him right out of the Phantasm. Honestly, uh, so it turns out that you can do banana on shield, re-grab banana on shield. Mm -hmm. Like with Tink yeah, Bombs? Yeah, you can do double, and it's just like, why? Yeah. Why would you do this to me? But uh, as I was saying, like, um, Diddy Kong has to sort of back off from his pressure game to farm for his banana because he does this whole animation that throws banana in the air and then he has to go catch yeah. it. So that's like sort of a relief for most characters whenever he goes for that banana. But once he actually lands banana in his hand, his pressure game is suddenly oh, no. just two times better. Oh, yeah. Like... Diddy Kong without banana. Still a very good character, Diddy Kong with banana. Top tier. Top tier. <laughs> Reminds me of uh, Z ZSS in Brawl, where she started with, yeah, with uh, her armor pieces. With armor. And she she was like, three armor pieces. Yeah, she was like S tier yeah. at the beginning of the match. But as soon as those armor pieces disappeared, she was, you know. She was like mid tier. Yeah. <laughs> and then there was Meta Knight, who was just good throughout the entire game. Oh, yeah. Oof. Tries to catch him out with down smash, but lucky able to get yeah. the shield up in time. Luckily, uh, shield comes Luckily. out frame one. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Shield oh. comes out frame one. So... After like any sort of move, as soon as that end lag is over, as long as you're holding shield, you'll go into shield. Exactly. You don't have to like time it perfectly. Thank hey, goodness. That would be just another layer to the, uh, the amount of stuff you need to know for this game. Oh, 
gives up ledge uh, so that Luck can never Yeah, I don't think spot. he was expecting the ledge perfect. A lot of the time, you'll see players like Luck, ooh, get in with the rando up hitbox of the forwards, man. Yeah, that little start up where, like, his foot just leaves the ground in the windmill kick, that's mm -hmm. where it'll hit up. Yep. And uh, so, you know, Luck, like, players like Luck will kind of do things that will seem dumb. Like, he'll, he'll go for the ledge perfect when someone is at the ledge. Because he's like, they're going to think that I'm going to do something else and try to cover that option. You know, it's that that stupid tech. You know, when you got to go back to your roots of doing really silly stuff to confuse people into thinking that you're going to do something really good. Yeah. You know? Uh, Zeus has a thing oh, yes. that says, um, if I just play unpredictably every single time, then there's no way that they can read me in neutral. <laughs> yeah, he... Like, playing Sonic is a very good example of that. Oh, yeah. Dude, Birdman is so good at just, like, getting the banana. Oh, there you go. Look at that AGT. Look at that. So saucy. Yeah, he AGTs out for this perfect distance to sweet spot that ledge beside me. So good. Super. Right. Unfortunately, at a very high percent, so yeah. many straight hits will just outright kill him. Just or like a, a just banana, a banana. Bro. Just a banana. That's a straight hit, right? Dude, the banana actually packs a bit of a wall, honestly. Ooh. I love that. He side B, edge cancels, fall up, turn around, laser. Mm -hmm. Oh, my goodness. He's got it down, man. He's got the Falco stuff. All right, jab grab from Luck. Tries to get him with the runoff dash attack. All right, combo start here. Oh, man. All right, he tries to get the dare onto the, the tech in place, but Birdman wisely teching in. One thing about Diddy is, like, his punish game is deceptively... It's, it's just deceptive. Oh, oh, no! no. Like in, in unison. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> As, as I was saying, like, Unlucky. Diddy's punish game is mostly like tech chases and banana setups. Tech chases, banana setups. But then he also has a lot of stuff like vertically. Yeah. Like if with up can, smash, up tilt, and then nair. If you can get them not DIing right for like aerials. Yeah, it takes like two seconds for you to stack on like 24 damage. Yeah. And for just, you know, missing one bit of STI. But on the opposite end of the spectrum, you get Falco, who's like, oh, let me hit you randomly with this shine, and suddenly I can just tack on about 40 to 50% damage. Yeah, depending if you DI, right? And you're oh, in a bad there it situation. Is. All right. Ooh. Luck, did you see that? Luck DI'd onto the banana. Mm -hmm. So that so, he couldn't get followed. Yeah, so he couldn't get followed, because that, that was actually really smart. He DI'd onto the banana and teched away under the platform where he couldn't get touched. Really smart stuff there by Luck. Just micro plays like that. Gets lasered off stage right. a bunch and oh goes for the oh barely dodges that back air and that's a dead oh, the man. peanut popper. I mean he was dead before the peanut hit him, but it was an extra bit of hit. Dude, the peanut pop guns are so strong. Mm -hmm. All right, man, that was. That I was believe good. we're getting the run back. Of yeah, we are getting. We are getting lunchman versus luck. Um,